Making what sure. All right, here we are. Uh, Big Read, the world's biggest night show with Callie. Yes. How you doing? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm pretty good. I just. You gotta say my name though, like Callie. Callie, like yeah. that. I'm on it. Hey, yeah. for sure. I just found out today is your first time in the Bay Area. Yes. Where are you originally from? Atlanta. Atlanta. I went to Atlanta one time in my life, right? Okay, how for, was it? It was humid. It was hot. I walked out the airport and I was like, oh, hell <laughs> Take no. Take me back. Yeah, for sure. Because, you know, the weather out here depends on what part of the bay you're on. Like, right now it's kind of cold. That's so why I got the hoodie on yeah. and everything. But if I went back home on the other side of the water, it's, it's hot. Yeah. You feel me? So, um, in Atlanta, is it just always hot like that? It's like a humid hot. Out yeah. here, it's like a dry hot. It's like mm -hmm. dry heat. But, yeah, in Atlanta, it's, it's, it's bipolar, but it's usually always hot. For sure, for sure. It might sure. rain and pour for two minutes, and then exactly. it's sunny again, but it's hot as I was, hell. I was shocked. I was like, it's burning. It was like 102 degrees. It was pouring down rain. <laughs> I was like, this don't make no sense. No, it don't. I didn't get by there. I was only there for like three or four days though, but you know, I got to experience some cool things, you know what I mean? Yeah, some good food. I, I mean, I think I did. I, I was like, yo, I'm going to Waffle House. And everyone's like, that's not where you're supposed to go. I mean, I still eat at Waffle yeah, House. Yeah, okay. Because <laughs> they were telling me like there were some other spots in the city that I needed to check out that's yeah. more authentic, that's yeah. like more like homegrown. For what's, sure, yeah. what's some of your favorite places to eat at back home? Um, I'm going to go JJ's, uh, JJ's Wings and Fish and American Deli, okay. but I like for breakfast. I'm gonna say toast because mm. toast is bomb. You gotta go to toast. It's in Buckhead in uh, Midtown. Word, word, word. JJ's. That's like JJ's fish and chicken in the east, right? Okay, for sure. We got we we low key got one out here too. It be yeah. going crazy. Yeah, they put the little sugar dust. Okay. I don't know what it is. Ranch powder, whatever it is. On ranch there. powder. I, I don't, my my manager say that's what it is, but I right. think it's I okay. think it's sugar dust. Word, sugar <laughs> dust. Okay, I'm gonna have to look that up for sure. I need to make sure I have some sugar dust, and the next time I eat some food. Exactly. <laughs> I'm all about food. I don't know if you can tell, but like I really like to eat. I, I do too. Word. I don't know if well, you can tell. Look, uh, thank you for pulling up. You shiny. You're going crazy. You're having a crazy year. I just want to mention, by far, uh, we're the first top 40 station to play uh, area codes in the country. Okay, period. Thank there. you. Shout out to y'all. I me? appreciate you. You feel me? It's going crazy. Numbers are nuts. How you, how you feeling so far this year? Um, I'm feeling good. Honestly, it's the Cali Takeover, so mm -hmm. I'm just sucking it all up and working hard. Yeah, and you just got nominated for a VMA Best New Artist. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Well, hopefully we see you hit the stage, yeah. perform. Yeah, for sure. That, we're definitely working on that. Hell yeah, that's super dope. Now, with your name Callie, where, like, is that short for something? Where, where, how, where'd your name come about? Um, so my name is Kalia. It's definitely, Callie is short for Kalia. Mm -hmm. But uh, I was born in Cali too. So, and it's, I, when I was playing soccer, it was easier for people to say Callie instead of my name because... You know, it, I, don't, I was getting like Kalaya and yeah. Kayla and people was just messing my name up. So. Word, you got a beautiful name though. Thank you. Word, now like you said you were born in Cali? Yeah. What part? I was born in Bellflower, but my family is from Carson. Mmm, yeah. okay, for sure, for sure. Yeah. That's what's up. My dad would love your hat right now. Oh, the Raiders? <laughs> oh, man. I'm a, a Raiders fan. Die Hard Raiders. Yeah, you know, we, yeah. we've been going through it for yeah. a long time. But he still, stick, he still stick beside them. No matter what. You yeah. not a Raider fan? I, I don't. I don't really watch football. Okay. okay. Yeah. You watch soccer? Uh, sometimes, yeah. Okay. I, I did when I was younger, but now I just been focusing on music and paying attention more to music. Hell yeah, the music is the focus. Yeah. Your mic got cut. Oh, my mic got cut. Yeah. We love that. <laughs> Mid interview. Mid convo. Camera's still rolling though. Camera's still. So we still locked in. So you know you don't watch soccer as much. You just focus on the music, focus on the writing, focus on mm -hmm. everything like that. Yes. That's dope. What are you currently like working on like right now? What you got cooking in the kitchen? Um, so I just dropped my, my song Kato and that's been going crazy. Facts. And then um I've been working on my tape that's coming soon called Toxic Girls Need Love Too. Mm -hmm. So I've been in the studio working on that and I'm about to go on tour. So I just been practicing to go on tour with A Boogie and Tusi. For sure, that's what's yeah. up. That's super lit. Yeah. Two other dope, talented artists that's going yeah. crazy as well, having crazy years. Yeah. Where where do you get your musical influence from? Like who who are some of the artists that you take after? Because like right now, like hip hop, I'ma say it, is is ran by the ladies right now. Exactly. Ladies going crazy. Yeah. So who do you who do you take influence from within your music? Um, definitely Missy Elliott and Aaliyah. She was just so like 
chill and like effortlessly beautiful and like it was just like a bad b but you she had to try so hard you know yeah. what i'm saying and missy was just like so creative in her visuals and the dancing and just her music like i just yeah for sure i've seen a lot of dancing in your videos you know what i mean missy's one of the greatest artists of all time yeah i don't think she get enough credit for what she's already done and everything and she continues to embrace Artists on the rise. Have you had a chance to chop it up with her though? I haven't got to meet Miss Lee, but I know it's on the way. What? Well, hell yeah. Yeah. Manifest that. Make that happen. Yeah. That's super lit. So, uh, VMA nomination, records going crazy, project on the way. What else are you looking forward to in uh, 2023? Um, definitely winning some award, more awards, mm -hmm. okay? Going platinum with area codes and just continue to make good music and hitting them charts. Hell yeah. That's what's yeah. up. Well, look, I appreciate you pulling up on me. I appreciate you spending a few minutes. Uh, a message for your fans uh, that have been following you since the beginning. Like, what do you what do you want to tell the people? What do you want to say to them? I just want to say we made it. And it's going to continue to be a Caddy Takeover. Period. Facts. Word. Word. Yeah. It's 99.7 now. Yeah.